adults and children with disabilities spent the day out at UNM learning an adapted sport. While it was the first festival of its kind here in Albuquerque, organizers say this is only the beginning of building more awareness here in our community. Let's go! Hand cycling. <laughs> table tennis and wheelchair basketball. Participants at the first annual UNM Disability Sports Festival prove the games are limitless. David Gonzalez plays basketball for the Albuquerque Kings and says this festival is the first step toward rebuilding the overall lack of awareness for disabled sports. Honestly, we're blessed, man. I mean, uh, I I've come from Oklahoma, Texas, where there's a lot of uh, programs for people with physical disabilities. And when I moved back here, I was, I was, um, I was saddened by the fact that there is, there's really no programs out there. It's that very reason UNM opened its doors to help open the disabled community to more recreational opportunities. There's a festival in Southern California at the Cal, at Cal State San Bernardino that has now 800 participants, and they started eight years ago with only 20 in their first year. So that's our goal, is that each year we just keep getting better and bigger and um, the word gets out and more and more people start taking advantage. Of you just got to do with the best you can. Keep going. It is what it is. We're trying to provide people with uh, the awareness that we're still here and that we're still alive and that we can still do so many things, maybe in a different way, but our perseverance is like no other. We're still now we are told that only about 15 people turned out for today's event, but as you just saw, everyone was in very good spirits and had a great time, so you can expect this will only continue to grow in the years to come. All right, well, it was a perfect day to be outside, and Eddie...